Okay, Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Uh, we are from group 1 uh, and we will present about uh, group, our group project uh, which is uh, CMMS and uh, Autodesk Revit. Alright, next. Uh, this is uh, this are our group members uh, starting with me Azam Amshari Ben Azmi uh, and second Diva Shinya dan Perempuan Saravanan and lastly Tuan Nona Suha binti Tuan Ibrahim uh, this is our table of contents uh, starting with introduction uh, for a big location and CMMS and second uh, uh, followed by CMMS White Cloud X and Preventive and Corrective Maintenance After that, asset and spare part management, process of complaint, and finally conclusion. For introduction, uh, for Sremang Gateway is our chosen uh, building for this project. It is an unforgettable place and unique experience in the culture for good food and shopping. A premier lifestyle complex with 45 retail lots and select units of rental kiosks spread over more than 200,000 square feet. It is near the State Museum and exit uh, of the KL Superman Highway. It is also uh, has other recreational spots to check out here in Superman Gateway like massage centre, bookstore, gym, computer shop and uh, beauty centre, optical shop and even sports centre. It is equipped with fire safety equipment such as staircase to ensure everyone at risk know to evacuate the building immediately. Moreover, there is also lift and escalator to make people go upper floor faster and easier. This is our building concept of Seremban Gateway. Uh, we are we using uh, the Autodesk Revit software to do this uh, building. Alright, next I will pass to Diva. Next is computerized maintenance management system uh, defined as a system, a software that centralizes maintenance information and simplifies maintenance operation processes. CMMS helps in optimization of physical equipment, utilization and availability such as cars, machinery, communications, plant infrastructure and other assets. Also used in manufacturing, oil and gas production, power generation, construction, transportation, and other industries. A CMMS helps to create, complete, and track digital work orders. The information in a CMMS database supports various functions of the system, which enable firstly resource and labor management, next asset registry work order management, preventive maintenance, materials and inventory management and also reporting, analyzing and auditing. Then, White Cloud X. White Cloud X is a cloud-based maintenance management software that puts you in a control of entire operation. This is the White Cloud X ma uh, system, maintenance system. White Cloud X offers ERP and IoT system. Uh, ERP stands for Enterprise Resources Planning which aims to increase productivity of companies and manage costs. IoT is Internet of Things which helps in monitoring and control devices from system to increase efficiency. Next, I will pass to Suha. The preventive and corrective maintenance in the CMMS and White Cloud Apps. The preventive maintenance is a routine schedule maintenance performed on a piece of equipment. It also to ensure its continued usage and extend its life. Meanwhile, for corrective maintenance is an emergency work order that direct maintenance activities to perform work following harm or any issues. Next. Preventive maintenance is recommended to minimize the equipment and also break down due to schedule conflict and the cost of schedule servicing, servicing is neg negligible in comparison to the cost of dealing with and of forcing and disastrous analysis which entails. It's also not only significant repair but also the replacement of pretend components and the system. In white cloud ads, preventive maintenance is enabled to define an unlimited number of calendar best on preventive maintenance tasks for each asset and automatically generate preventative 
maintenance task based on the time, uh, days, week, or month, and meter reading. We also enable to conduct inspection round quickly and accurately. Next. This is the process of preventive maintenance. Firstly, we have to firstly automatically initiate a pre preventive maintenance work order. Number two, for view current and upcoming PM activities notification and sign to the assigned technician when a PM is generated. Next. Number three, capture the inspection start and stop time in real time. To view the inspection instruction and indicate whether the inspection was successful or unsuccessful. Number four, you will increment the speed and inspection. Then we need to create a corrective new to create a corrective order. Number five, you produce QR code for each asset that technician can scan with your mobile device for easily uh, for any easily access. Next. For the corrective maintenance is performed after a breakdown has occurred and is intent to restore an item to a state where it can perform its required function such as to maintain and replace it. Next, the, this is the process of corrective maintenance which is we have to open work order and approve. Uh, number two is when equipment fails and inspection. Uh, we have to create a corrective work order which is create a customer workflow for submitting, approving, rejecting and copying work request order. Next. Alright, for... Thank you, Suha. Alright, for asset and paper. Next. Uh, firstly, uh, starting with uh, asset management. It is successful asset management as in figure 1. Boils down to tracking by effectively tracking asset maintenance history, user will gain the ability to make data-driven decisions and significantly reduce failures. Next. It's also maintain asset template, information and generate barcode labels for all assets to enable rapid and seamless access. After that, create calendar-based preventative maintenance plans for each asset to ensure that all scheduled maintenance is performed on time and correctly and then include detailed documentation of all work performed on each asset including photograph, documents and link. View detailed information about each asset, work history, failures and warranty to assist you in making budgeting decisions. For the spare part management, access detailed information about all components in a list view including their location, quantity of hand, unit cost and item number. Attach are images of the component for easy identification. Assign component to asset and PMs to inform technicians automatically which part are required to repair an asset or complete a PM assignment. Uh, next, utilize QR codes to rapidly scan and assess parts records on your mobile device uh, and required to submit a part request for approval prior to charging out the part. Next, I will pass to Suha. Thank you. This is the process of complaint. Okay, preventive maintenance. Firstly, create a new preventative maintenance order. So, in this picture, we have to fill in the location, section, asset, and the type. Next. Number, the process number two, we have to select the date and write the complaint on the description below. And after fill in the description and complaint, we have to submit the order at this point and have to wait the response, the issue from the other group or worker before making confirmation and verify the sign the issue has stayed. Next. And the last, select the date and write the complaint on the description. Next. In the other hand, uh, for corrective maintenance, firstly, we have to make a new order by clicking the new order in the corrective maintenance section. Uh, we have to assign a location, asset, breakdown, date, defective, and category person or worker will fill out the information, include the picture, and submit the order. This is the picture uh, state in the white cloud ads for corrective maintenance system. Next, I will pass to Diva. Lastly, conclusion. As a conclusion, uh, White Cloud S is an essential software and system to create the building model as well as a system maintenance management software that puts in command 
to the building operation. It makes easier to engage with the other group of workers by response to the issue and making impact on the resources. With using computerized maintenance management system (CMMS), it helps management track activities in the maintenance team. Thus, will fewer the equipment purchases and replacement because of the regularly schedule of keeping update the maintenance activity in White Cloud X, as well as work significantly from a standardized asset identification system in which each piece of equipment or building component is given an identification number common to all facilities throughout an organization. That's all from us. Thank you.